Anastasia, the Princess of Variety, and I am back with my Bad Girls Club 15 trailer review, I guess I can call this. A lot of you guys were asking me to do a BGC 15 sneak peek reaction video or a Bad Girls Club season 15 trailer reaction video. So here I am. I'm giving you guys what you asked for. I told you guys I would do this video. So here it is. So I'm just going to tell you guys I did not watch any sneak peeks. I watched some of the sneak peeks like months ago, months ago when they first started getting released, but I did not watch any sneak peeks recently for the sake of this video. I just watched the trailer and if you guys want to see the trailer, here it is. So everything I'm saying right now is basically based off of what I've seen from the trailer and I guess from some of the sneak peeks I watched months ago, but most of what I'm saying is based off of what you just watched. I think the idea of having sisters in the house instead of just random strangers, I think this is a really cool idea. I think this might actually be something really good for the Bad Girls Club franchise because Bad Girls Club has not been doing so well with ratings and stuff. I mean, I used to be so into Bad Girls Club. I used to talk about it all the time, tweet about it all the time, make videos on it all the time. Now it's kind of like, huh, another season of people acting stupid. I mean, like, I just feel like Bad Girls Club has changed and not for the better. I feel like the older seasons are way better than these newer seasons. It's just all about jumping and... It's, it's just stupid. I don't like the new seasons, which is why I stopped doing season reviews because it was just kind of like, I don't know. Like, it just, it's, it's just going downhill. So I feel like this season could actually be a really good season. I mean, the trailer actually looks good for once. Because I haven't really seen a really, really good trailer in a while. Um, and sometimes the trailers are better than the actual season, which is kind of weird, but I think the season will actually be good. Based off of the trailer, I think the girls seem really cool. I mean, I think when they talk to the life coach, it's going to be more interesting just because it's going to be two family members instead of just one girl talking about her life. It's going to be a lot more um, emotional and it's going to be a lot more behind it, a lot more background just because there's two people instead of just one person. I just think it'll be more interesting to watch. As you guys could see, the two sisters were kind of going back and forth about what they were talking about and they were kind of fighting about it and it was getting really intense. I think that's going to be good for this show because it's not just people fighting. It's more interesting. It's more behind it and I like that. I honestly don't know if I'm going to do episode reviews like I used to for this season because I feel like every time I've started doing season like reviews on a season it'll the season gets really really whack really really fast so I just kind of fall off like I'll do like four reviews on like the first four episodes and then I'll just stop and I won't review the rest of the season and it's just because I feel like Bad Girls Club has not been as good as it used to be so I kind of want to be cautious and kind of See if I'm going to do reviews. I think it'll be really fun to get back into doing reviews because I really liked doing reviews for um, for Bad Girls Club, but uh, I just want to make sure I'm going to actually review every single episode, if not most of them, instead of just doing like a few and then kind of stopping until the end of the season. But if I don't do episode reviews every week or whatever, I'll probably do a season review. I mean, I usually always do a review at the end of the season anyways, regardless of if I really like the season or not. And I also did not watch the casting special that came on this past Tuesday. I'm going to watch it probably tomorrow, which is Monday, um, and kind of watch it before the season comes on and kind of get an idea of what the girls are like. Because I feel like another thing with Bad Girls Club for me that I've noticed over the past few years is that if you watch like all the sneak peeks, you basically know what's going to happen on the entire season. If you follow the girls on Twitter, if you watch the sneak peeks, if you follow like the BGC bloggers and stuff like Joey BGC blogger and if you follow like A Connection TV and BGCT and stuff like that if you follow those people you kind of get to see a lot of what's going to happen there's a lot of spoilers and stuff and I feel like for me personally Bad Girls Club was a lot more interesting when you didn't know everything that was going to happen in a season before the season even came out it's just more it's just 
more to look forward to. If you watch all of the sneak peeks and stuff and you see every single thing that's going to happen, for me personally, it just makes it not as fun to watch. Like the older seasons, they're my all-time faves, but BGC9 is like my top fave. And I feel like back then, I didn't watch like sneak peeks and all that stuff. I would just watch the trailer and then I'd watch the season and everything that happened in the season was a surprise to me because I hadn't seen all of these sneak peeks and interviews prior to watching the season. So yeah, I think that makes a huge difference. So yeah, basically that's it guys. I'm pretty excited for the season. I am going to watch the first episode um, on Tuesday. So the first episode is going to be on March 15th, which is this upcoming Tuesday, and it's going to air at 8, 7 central on Oxygen. So make sure you guys tune in. And thank you guys so much for watching this video. I love when you guys request videos and kind of tell me what you guys want to see. Thank you guys so much for requesting this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm sorry if this wasn't me going in depth really about every single thing that I've seen so far but I kind of don't really want to ruin it for anyone I just kind of want to give you guys a basis of what I feel about the trailer itself and thank you guys so much for watching I really really appreciate you guys tuning in I love you guys so much make sure you give this video a huge thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys next time bye guys